Hey there folks and welcome to day 8 of Summer of DX 2016. Today we are playing Galactic Hitman. This game was gifted to me on Steam by, because I shouldn't, I sure as hell didn't buy this, uh, Groilic, who loves gifting me bad games. Um, he called this a gallon of pure shit. So, uh, we'll, we'll see. I mean, I've already played this. I played this for top 15 worst games of 2015, but this is just something else. This, this is so horrible. Um, the game is about clearing invaders of uh, space stations, and you have all these different... You have six bases. Um, spoiler, they're all the same fucking base. Uh, or at least I think so. I think they're all a, the exact same base, and if they're not, it's very different in, the ter in terms of level design. They're practically the same base. And this menu is running at 22 frames per second right now. That's absurd. And it's not because there's like a fucking pre-rendered cutscene. So the thing is telling me it's running at the frame rate that the pre-rendered cutscene is running at. No. This is this is all in-game content right here. And I, I if I had to guess, it's because there's three different 3D models on screen right now. So... Who knows? But let's get six frames per second. Holy shit! Uh, let's get into Horizon Base. Start, I guess. This base is clear. Choose another. Oh, okay. So I guess that. I guess because I already beat it, I, I cleared that base. Is this one cleared? Yeah, I guess it is. So wait, maybe not. The game fucking froze. Hopefully it's not going to crash now. Nope. Yeah, here we go. Uh, okay, so right off the bat, um, the aiming is, is terrible. The guy's hand... And, and some of the bullets don't even fire correctly. Like, I'm pressing this multiple times, and I only get, like, two or three shots. Uh, reloading animation is okay, I guess. Uh, there is uh, aim down sights. It looks awful. Let me reload. All right. Uh, also, yeah, there's shift to run. There's shift to run because fuck this game. Oh, hold up. Oh, shit. I'm taking him on. Oh, I'm dead. Right. Uh, okay, so you see this crouching m m mechanic that we have here, which looks like shit. It looks like I'm crawling through the fucking trenches in, in Iwo Jima. But, um, so I'm crouching right now, and they can't hit me. And this guy's just, this guy is so fucking scared of me, he's paralyzed in fear. Uh, this other guy right here is just shooting at fucking, I don't know, the air. Let's kill this motherfucker quick. That's how, that's how awful this game is. That, I mean, just, I, I can't believe how fucking awful this game is. I really cannot. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, and here's the fucking thing about this game. It is impossible to take these people on unless you exploit this mechanic. And by the way, they still, they can still hit you occasionally. But if you crouch, they're, most, they're much less likely to actually hit you. Of course, uh, if you guys didn't know, this is a digital homicide game. One of their best. And these guys aren't even firing. Oh, no, they're firing now. Okay, they seem to fire every time you, uh, you let go of C, which is crouch, they will start firing. What the fuck was that? Typical digital homicide bullshit, not labeling oil barrels correctly, because they don't know how to do game design. Fuck, man. Target down! Target down! Am I gonna get to heal anywhere? Is this a healing pod? Whoa, what is this? Oh, okay, uh, Q and E switches weapons. The mouse scroll doesn't doesn't even switch weapons. By the way, why the fuck did they give you a knife in this game? This is gonna be fucking useless. This has to be a joke. There's no- you can't do this with a knife. Watch, I'm gonna- shit, okay, ho watch this. I'm gonna try to do this with a knife. Let's rush the motherfucker. I- I don't even know what happened there. What the fuck? What the- what the fuck? Let's try and do it again. Let's rush them. Oh, okay. These guys are dead. So we gotta rush these motherfuckers. Let's do it. The knife does- uh, the knife 
Did it, did it even kill him? Did it kill me? Who knows? Okay, so I got a target down. Wow, this looks really fucking bad. Yeah, so you could just massacre the entire, yeah. All the fucking invaders and shit like that. I just noticed also that when you enter ADS, your crosshairs uh, disappears. Alright, let's go. What the fuck? See? I'm dead. <laughs> I'm dead. I had no time to react. That's how, that's how horrendous the level design is in this game, where it's just room after room of enemies. There's no... Wait a minute, hold on. Okay, see? Yeah. Let's, I, I'm, I'm happy we're, we did that, because who knows what could have happened. By the way, I'm going to try shooting an oil barrel. Bo barrel. Blech. No, but that's the thing about the, the design in this game. It's absolutely horrendous, because... It's the most simplistic thing you could ever think of, and it's not even done in a correct way. It's not even done properly. By the way, I'm just I'm just holding down mouse at this point. I'm not even I'm not even uh, clicking individually now. <laughs> Look at this fucking shit! Oh, I can't believe this is being sold on Steam. <laughs> By the way, that's the same fucking font. The, that Digital Homicide uses for the Slaughtering Grounds logo. <laughs> oh my god, this is so bad. Uh, let's try Orion Base. I just want to see if it's the same fucking level that, it, <laughs> that all the other ones have been. Oh my goodness. Okay, that's weird. The mouse just... Wow, look at that. Wow. Wow. Um, one thing I really want to show, and, and I want to show how incompetent the level design is in this fucking piece of shit, is the doors that lead to nowhere. Like this! Like this! This is a door that leads to a fucking door! Who- I- What? Alright, let's go in, boys. Let's do this shit. Target down! Target down! Okay, this is one of the doors. Almost 100% guaranteed. This door is either going to lead to a fucking window, or nothing. Oh, shit! Is it this one? Okay, see, this is the door that leads to a window. Incredible! I was wrong. It wasn't this door. This door actually leads to enemies. But what the fuck is the point... Of having a door here that leads to a window. Even if there wasn't a window over here, it's fucking useless. Who designed this? Let's kill some motherfuckers. Let's do it. I got plasma bullets for every one of those motherfuckers. Target down. You know, them exploding was not indication enough that the target was down. <laughs> Look at the fucking box. By the way, I'm gonna try to I'm gonna try to outrun this enemy. I'm gonna try to actually shoot him as you would in a first person shooter. See, it's possible, I guess, to kill enemies like that, but it, Oh my god! Again. And now I'm gonna have to run all that way. Through the two doors. Through over here. And here's the thing. Every level so far, I'm pretty sure, has been. You know, you just go straight. So, if you just go straight here, you it get you lead it leads to a window. I, I still can't believe that. That that to me is just so horrible. All right, this is where we were before. Let's switch to the Actually, you know what? Let's switch to the grenade. Let's see if the grenades actually do a fucking thing in this game. Uh, that guy's still standing. Uh, he was hit point blank with a grenade. Still standing, no problem. I'm just gonna throw multiple grenades. I'm gonna throw one over here, see if it does anything. Okay, that hit me. That hit me, and somehow I went to 101 health. I'm pretty sure I was in 90 before. 
Uh, here's the knife. Actually, you know what? Let me see something. Because this game is so horrible that you could just you could just crouch to enemies and not take any damage. This guy... Oh, my God. Okay. Ah! <laughs> of course. Of course. You would hit him and he would explode. <laughs> what the fuck? Oh, my goodness. Hold on, this guy's not ready. There we go. <laughs> I stab him in the leg and he fucking explodes. That's so rich. Oh my god. My god, the crouching in this is fucking awful. Target down, target down, target down. Oh, uh, this is the greatest thing. He's not even looking at me, he's looking over there. <laughs> Oh my god. Target down. Target down. Target down. Oh shit, let's go. Is this space Okay, no. This is This is not where we're supposed to be. What does this room do? Where does this lead us? This doesn't do anything. I hate useless rooms in video games. Although Wait, there was another room over here, I think. Is this another door that leads to a wall? Please don't be. Oh fucking shit. Yeah. So what was the point of killing all these people here? Was it as a distraction before we get to these guys? It's fucking shit, man. This is awful. Digital homicide. Like I don't even. I don't like. You know, talking shit about developers. Like even, even developers I dislike. I will just go as far as to say that the games they make are shitty. But these guys, how how could you sell something like this? How could you put something like this on Steam? I'd be ashamed to have put something like this on fucking Steam. Oh my god! You know, I want to see if this game is so horrendous that this is a... Uh... Oh my god, it's another fucking window. I wanted to see if that led to the exit, but I guess it doesn't. Then again, I think that goes uh, against the purpose of the game, which is to clear the bases of uh, enemies. There's the last guy here. Yeah, base clear, of course. Well, that's gonna be it for me. I am done playing fucking... I was about to say the... I was about to say the, the name of the game we're playing tomorrow. Um, no, I'm done playing Galactic Hitman. This is... This is awful. This is one of the worst FPSs I've played. And I... I always have trouble... You know, considering these even games, because they're half-baked projects that have no business being compared to other games that have had actual development teams and stuff like that. So, I, I, I don't know what to say. Uh, this is fucking awful. Uh, a big thank you again to Groylik, who gifted me this game on Steam. If you guys want to support the channel, uh, you can visit my Patreon. I'll put the link in the description. And uh, I hope you guys stick around for more Summer of DX 2016 content tomorrow. Uh, I'll just spoil it. We're playing another digital homicide game. Uh, but you'll have to tune in tomorrow to see what game that is. Uh, thank you guys for watching. Peace out.